Hey guys, Joe here, back to the Word. Just wanted to talk today about check your perspective. I'm in Galatians 5.16, which says, I say then, walk by the Spirit, and you will certainly not carry out the desires of the flesh. I recently had the opportunity to go to a work conference, and there was a breakout about being married and ministry, and balancing the two without hating both. And it was really great. The first bullet point the guy went through, he says, walk with God. And I just, as I woke up this morning and saw Galatians 5.16 as the verse for the day, I just wanted to share that because it reminded me of that lesson that I need to check my perspective daily, that I need to elevate and walk by the Spirit. Paul here in the book of Galatians is talking about the desire of a believer that we need to walk by the Spirit. We need to be checking in with God daily to have a correct perspective or else we will walk according to the flesh. Our natural pull is going to be towards the flesh and towards our sinful desires, but we need to be people of God who walk by the Spirit. The guy who was leading the breakout said, he said, when I'm in the trenches in my marriage, when I'm in the trenches in ministry, I don't have a right perspective. I go based on my natural instinct, and I need to walk by the Spirit. And he said, when I walk with God, I can see better. I see the right perspective. Naturally, sometimes we're just so close to something we can't see rightly. But when we walk by the Spirit, when we seek God, when we invite Him into our decision making, He allows us to see things for what they are. He shows us who people really are and how we're supposed to lead in our lives. Maybe you've made some bad decisions. You've went against God. You've went against the Spirit and towards the flesh. Today, you can choose. Ask God. Say, help me to walk by your Spirit. I encourage you to walk with God today and get a right perspective in your life. God bless. See you guys soon.